Dear Pastor Bob, on day 98 in your Metal Devo book, you talk about having time with God early in the morning. That's when I read my Bible and say my prayers. But I wonder how you pray. I try and take some breaths and focus my thoughts to try and connect with God's Spirit. But I imagine being with conversation with Jesus, and I sometimes feel like I'm rattling things off on a list. How do you engage with our Lord? Great question. And so many people are really frustrated in prayer, and it's not hard. Prayer is simply talking. And honestly, prayer with God is mostly, listen, listening. <laughs> not talking, not really saying anything. Getting to the place where you're communicating with them and you're developing a sense of hearing. Now, I want to say, first of all, that the Holy Spirit lives inside of you. We've talked about that a lot of times. The Holy Spirit works from the inside out, not the outside in. And when we're thinking about communicating with God, a lot of times it's this way. That's not how it works. It's this way. And when I communicate with God, I listen. What is he saying in my innermost being? How is he leading me? And very honestly, my times in the morning when I read and, and I study and, and I pray, those aren't my best times of praying. They never are. My best times are throughout the day when I realize he's leading me, when I encounter something and I realize he's instructing me, when I'm doing a podcast like this and I start saying things that I haven't thought of before, which happens almost every day, honestly. I don't have a script for this. I don't study anything. I have a question and I turn it on. And what comes out? Well, sometimes it's good. Sometimes it's not great. But I feel like it's God leading and I love that part. And I think that's the key. It's all day long, every day, communicating, listening. Sometimes telling God how I feel throughout the day. Sometimes hearing him lead me through a situation, but it's always that sense of personal, inside of me, communication. Now, that is the key, I think, to prayer. It has been for me. I, the, I only start and finish a prayer when I'm praying in public with other people. I never finish a prayer otherwise. It's just a constant communication I think that's what prayer is supposed to be about. If it's conversing with someone else, that's how we do it in real life anyway. Every time, if you're married, every time you see your wife, if you greet her and then finish it, and you see her again, you do the same thing. Or you just have one time during the day when you talk, and then you don't really talk the rest of the time. And yeah, you, got, you see where I'm going with that. It's a relationship. And you know, guys who are married, sometimes the best thing you can do is just shut up and listen. Seriously. It's a good thing to learn how to do. And it's a good thing to learn how to do in our relationship with God, too. So I guess I would just say, first of all, pray all the time. The Bible says pray without ceasing. And then make sure that you're listening here. He's talking. You just got to listen. God bless you. Have a great day. Oh.